Lev and I are we're we're lucky men. <laughs> oh my gosh. No. <laughs> I always noticed that Jillian never really found someone to focus her attention on. Someone who could captivate her attention. I stole the attention from her. You were the best and are the best sister that I could ever imagine. Oh, you're so good. Oh, thank you. Oh, look at you. Look at you. You look so handsome too. Oh. <laughs> I love take you, Jillian. I, Jillian, take you, love. To be my wife. To be my husband. And I always tried to get that attention from her. I wanted the approval, right, of your older sibling. And then comes love. Oh my God. Oh, beautiful. Thank you. This is the thing I couldn't see. This you couldn't thing, see this. This is what I had to hide in the basement. Yes. Unbelievable. Oh, you look so handsome. Oh, and Lev, I just want to tell you, and I mean this, I am so thankful that you are a man worthy of her attention. I would tell you that today is a great day. It's a happy day. My daughter is married, and uh, I'd like to say to Lev and Jillian, look at this room. Look around you. You're surrounded by family. You're surrounded by friends, you're supported, and you're loved. Together, we have created this ceremony by weaving from the threads of Jillian and Lev's two traditions. You know, there's some things in life that you have to earn. You have to earn trust, you have to earn respect, you have to earn good grades, right? But you don't earn love. You give love, you receive love. So Jillian, you don't have to earn his attention anymore. He's already given it to you. It's all over his face. And I'm so glad. I'm so glad to have a brother. To Jillian and Love. My brother is a very special person. I mean, his heart, just the, the level of care that he has for people, he will be your biggest cheerleader. He will be your biggest supporter. I've never met anyone who genuinely wants so much good for everyone. Jillian truly has the kindest heart and will do anything for anyone. She's a rare person who really cares, and I'm so grateful for our friendship. I met Lev in the ninth grade. Uh, he was a bouncy old Jewish boy coming out of Hebrew school, heading into the public schools. Um, we really, we instantly became good friends. So I remember when Lev first met Jillian, I could tell right away there was something special. She was special. After a few nights, it was clear that, you know, they were really a perfect match. Uh, Jillian laughs at all his jokes, you know, and Lev always knows how to show her a good time, take her out. Oh,